What are you watching? Hmm? Have you seen this? Another TikToker has a reality TV show. What is that, like six, seven now? Feels weird and scary. What are we talking about here? Dancing? I can't, I really honestly don't understand why they would make another reality TV show with a TikTok star. There's no way people sit here for seven minutes to watch this. Can I skip through this? Oh, I can. What? Oh, there's ads as well? I really don't think we need another reality show about another TikToker, but here we are. This one seems like a good one. Addison Rae returns to her roots in Louisiana to show fans a more personal side than they have ever seen before. Is that why Addison Rae is wearing a cowboy hat in the pool? Because that's what people in Louisiana do, right? Addison Rae returns to her roots by eating crawfish. Oh my gosh, I haven't had crawfish in so long, actually. Ah! What's going on everyone? Welcome back to The Asher Show. I had no idea that this existed. Addison Rae Goes Home, a Snapchat original reality TV series. So I don't know if you guys know this, but Snapchat has a lot of original shows. I honestly thought the app was dead, but I guess it's popular amongst Gen Z. I, I think it's like the fourth most popular social media app. Snapchat has moved away from being a place where you can just share stories or message underage kids. <laughs> Because now they have so many great original TV shows. Nikita Dragon has her own reality show here on Snapchat. So does Lauren Gray. She used to be the number one influencer on TikTok. I branded myself with long hair, so now I just have to have long hair. Oh man, Lauren Gray is just like us. I'm so glad that she has this reality TV show so she can tell us about the troubles of having long hair. She's so brave. Will Smith has not one, but I'm pretty sure he has two original Snapchat shows. Oh, of course, Charlie and Dixie D'Amelio have a show together. Of course. I'm Dixie. And I'm Charlie. Oh, oh no! And we're going head to head in a series of challenges no! to try and win $50,000 for the charity of our choice. I'm actually a little upset I have many invited to be on the show because you guys know that I'm a big fan of Dixie D'Amelio. But finally, way here, almost at the bottom, oh, Addison Ray Goes Home, a 10 episode docu-series which started last month. Let's watch a bit of the first episode to see how this show is because we all know that Addison Ray, she's a big Hollywood star. She's been in movies like he's all that. We all know about her amazing music career. And I said me too. So let's see how she is in uh, a reality TV show. Once upon a time, I was born in Louisiana. Then I picked up and moved my life to LA. I went from doing dance videos in my living room for friends to posting them to more than 80 million followers. It's brought me a lot of love, but with that comes a lot of hate. Now, I'll be going back home to Louisiana for a week with my mom, dad, and my two little brothers. We're going to the lake! I'm kinda nervous. Huh. Will I fit in back home? I wonder if it'll be like it used to. Okay, it's only been 33 seconds, and you already know where this premise came from, right? I'll give you a couple seconds to think about it. The world knows her as a superstar. Is that Hannah Montana? <laughs> but no one knows where she came from. Hannah Montana, the movie. Friggin' Hannah Montana, the movie. The premise of the show is Hannah Montana, the movie. Addison Rae is going from her illustrious life in Hollywood. Fame, fortune, Netflix original movies. And now she's going to Louisiana where she eats crawfish and feeds goats. I don't know who they think they're fooling here, but they're not fooling me. Back in business, baby. Back in Louisiana, I feel relaxed already. I hope everyone is the same as I remember them. I feel like some people have treated me a little differently, but yeah. I don't know, it's been so long. You know, two years is a long time. And with as much as we've done, it's a huge difference. And like, I feel like- You've grown. I've yeah. changed. Yeah. I'm just like, true. And I think change is good and necessary for growing up. And I'm not even the same person I was six months ago because I'm growing so much and like learning so much. I'm sure they've changed too. Addison, what are you talking about? Addison Rae's repeating herself. It's like when she's being interviewed, she just says the same thing over and over again. I just also at the same time, like that memory was almost gone, I mm -hmm. feel like at the time. Um, but like now that I think about it, I remember, I definitely only remember. How many times has she said grown, changed? It's a huge difference. And like, I feel like. You've grown. I've yeah. changed. Yeah. I'm just like. It's true, and I think change is good and necessary for growing up, and I'm not even the same person I was six months ago because I'm growing so much and, like, learning so much. I'm sure they've changed, too. I I'm growing so much, I've changed so much. I hope, hopefully, they haven't changed. It's a huge difference, and, like, you like... You keep saying the same thing. See? This kid gets it. Like, you keep saying the same thing. Let me say the same thing. 
Let me say the same thing. So far, this is a pretty good show. We've heard how she's grown, how she's changed. Changing and growing and changing. As much as I'm enjoying watching Addison Rae floating around in the pool with her cowboy hat, let's see what happens next. Let me say the same thing. Growing up, my family and I ate a shit ton of crawfish. And when you're from Louisiana, you better believe you're catching it yourself too. Getting out and away is exactly what I need to do to disconnect. She's not having a good time here. She's wiping the sweat off her face. She's almost tripping into the swamp. Oh my gosh, I'm sweating more than I've ever sweat. No matter how they try to frame it, Addison Rae is Hollywood now. I feel, I feel like, like I, I can, can relax, relax and be myself. myself. This is gonna take some getting used to again. Look at the picture that they use for the show. She's got cowboy boots on, she's got her little Daisy Dukes, but she's still using her phone. It's trying to show the best of both worlds. Does that look like the face of a person who's enjoying themselves? I don't think so. Does this feel nice to you to be able to be out here and, and not? <gasps> Look at the crawfish! I got one! That is the big daddy. Ah! Ooh, look at that big daddy. Look at them crawfish, huh? Ah! Come on, Addison, put some mud on your face. Get down with it. Ah! How can you not get into the Louisiana vibe? Country music playing in the background, crawfish rolling in. I'm still nervous to see my friends and family who knew me before everything. Don't get me wrong, I'm excited. I just hope they remember I'm the same person they've always known. Oh, we get to meet the family. This is going to be great because you know there's going to be some sort of inspirational speech here trying to let everyone know that Addison Rae is still human. Oh my god. What is she wearing? Every scene she needs at least one southern thing about her outfit just to make it seem like it's really Louisiana authentic. There are a lot of people I don't know who have sent me incredible amounts of support online. But there are also people who judge me without remembering that I'm human too. What are these comments? Is this Snapchat show really calling out these people? Sarah Hartu commented, I'd rather take advice from a potato. Ooh. Did someone screenshot these or do you think these are made up? Your fame will be as short lived as your fake highlights. Ooh, wee. Ooh. Oh, this girl is as dumb as a rock. Can I just search one of those names? It doesn't exist. Jessica Murez also doesn't exist. They're really trying to get sympathy here because these people don't exist. These aren't real comments. At least use real comments and blur it or something. All right, okay. who's ready for crawfish? Yeah. You can order any type of seafood here we go. in LA, but when it's caught and cooked by family, nothing tastes more comforting and nothing makes me feel safer than being around the people I love. Oh my gosh, I haven't had crawfish in so long, actually. Oh I was thinking about what thumbnail I should use for this video. So here's here are my ideas, okay? We have Addison Rae in the pool with her cowboy hat on. We have Addison Rae making this weird face. And then we've got Addison Rae holding crawfish and kissing the air and winking because, you know, she has her nails done, but she still eats crawfish. But what I'm thinking, we should probably use this because this is what she actually thinks about people that eat crawfish with their hands and suck out the head. <laughs> That's an authentic Addison Ray face. That's the face of somebody who loves going back home to Louisiana. Maybe I'll make this the thumbnail. I think I'm gonna try to suck the head. You're a Cajun girl, go do it. Do look, it. look. Don't Death do it. Girl. You get all the juice. You did it. That's actually good. Yeah, it's all the seasoning and the fat. You do need a little more brains. Oh, you got slammed by your, did you hear that? Did you hear that joke? You do need a little more brains. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Woo! And just being able to oh, like be lot. around familiar faces in every aspect and like people that just have known me the longest, you know? Let me say the same thing. The end of the first episode gets really soppy. Everyone starts hugging and Addison Rae starts doing a monologue about how she wants everyone to see the real her. I really hope this trip back home will help me figure out a way to show people more of who I am. I doubt it. She's still being pretty fake on this show, I'm not gonna lie. They're just posing on the wall over here. What's, is that an authentic pose? Standing there smiling in the distance? Okay, these are some titles. This is how Addison Rae deals with her haters. This moment will make your heart melt. Why is our heart melting exactly? It's just them walking in slow motion on this empty road. Can't believe what she just heard. These are titled like David Dobrik vlogs. Why why, why are these clickbait titles? There's 10 episodes, they're all like seven minutes each, and it ends with Will Addison move back to Louisiana. No, I'll save her the time. She's not gonna move back to Louisiana. I can't help but wonder how different things would be if I stayed in my hometown. You probably wouldn't be famous, that's for sure. You wouldn't be rich. I think you're fine, Addison Ray. Let's not try to pretend like you're gonna move back to Louisiana. And do what? What are you gonna do there? I'm sure I'd be like 
in college still. Addison Rae is dressed like she's doing a TED talk. She has a full turtleneck dress on, her nails are completely done up. Yeah, she's not moving anywhere. Hello. I love the rain. I do too. It's like honestly one of the best things about Louisiana. Gussie, please, someone let me know if you know anyone named Gussie because that's a name I've never heard in my entire life. So her and Gussie are hanging out with their classic, you know, you need to have on a cowboy hat because this is Louisiana. She doesn't let her friend talk once. It's really hard to have someone to talk to and like mm -hmm. be able to feel like not judged. Even people that I know in LA It's now, hard to find people to trust, like truly, because mm -hmm. a lot of people don't have your best interests like, against you. Yeah. Like my vulnerability and like mm -hmm. kindness is- You can watch the entire series uh, right here on the Snapchat website. I do feel like they're trying a little too hard to seem relatable. I, the structure of the show is a little weird. I feel like they kind of just went onto TripAdvisor and said, hmm. What is there to do in Louisiana? Okay, eat crawfish, check. Go to a hoedown, check. Hang out in a swamp, oh, double check. <coughs> Thank you everyone for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new because according to my graph here, 63.9% of people who watch my videos are not subscribed. And be sure to tune next time. <coughs> will use things against you. Yeah. Like my vulnerability and like mm -hmm. kindness has been taken